Into the Gooniverse here with another review. Alice in Borderlands Season 2 on Netflix. What's up, Grinder Games? Everybody died. Everybody didn't even... Everybody didn't even die. No. No, damn near everyone died in the game. And somehow they were still alive. Like that girl that got rattled up. Bottom, the top. And she still was alive somehow. Okay, let's get on that. Point blank. He went down to up. Shot her up. Number one. Then she crawled away. Dying. Then scenes later, she was crawling away and they showed her to pass out, die. Then scenes later, she was crawled all the way to a homie she loved, hugged him and died. Then scenes later, she was alive. <laughs> I don't know, but uh, it's dope. I like Atlas and Borderlands. It was good. I like the, uh, how the different... At this time, they played out the different cards, and each card had a different uh, person, like different person. I really enjoyed the uh, what card was he? King, spades, or no? Um, the, the, uh, the king of clubs. The guy when he kind of guided him, yeah, and told yeah, he kind of kinda guided him and pulled out his full potential. And that whole little game and how he was a loyalist. You know, me being a loyalist myself, I felt that. Like, he was like, man, I ride with my team. My team even. Like, we got a quality over here, Twana. And I was feeling that, dude. I like that character. That whole little game. I remember his name. And then they had the Bounty Hunter, which... How did he never run out of bullets? He did run out of bullets. He was military. I never him? saw him run out of bullets. You didn't pay attention, man. He was military fool. He was the king, the king of what? Oh, king no. of spades. But that motherfucker never ran out of bullets. But as far as I seen, and then I, I, it kind of fell off at the end with me when it was like the last game that plays the psychological one in the mind and out, and then it was like yes, no, yes, no. I was like, okay, what's going on in this block? Crazy, bro. I got confused at the very end. Yeah, it, it, it was strange on the play. And then I like how they leave a cliffhanger like it's another card and stuff, the wild card. But I'm down with Alice in Borderlands. It's a good show. I personally like season one more. But I still give season two like a good eight. What you give it? I give it a season two. I like season one more. It was darker to me, but... You know what I mean? Check it out yourself. Let us know what you think about it in the comments below. And we'll make sure you hit that subscribe. Turn on notifications. We'll catch y'all next time.